how do you get paid with affiliate marketing? Uh, you keep hearing about this and you're like, well, how the heck does that work? And there's all kinds of videos out there. I'm gonna take you, not only show you how you get paid, but I'm gonna show you how you set it up and how you even find them. Um, there, a lot of times you're told, you know, go to Amazon, Amazon, there's 10 billion items on there and you can promote those items and get paid. Yes, you can. It's a very easy way to do it, Amazon Associates, but you won't make a lot of money. But it is a great way to get started. And actually, a lot of your marketers, a lot of your influencers use Amazon kind of as an extra stream of income. For instance, on my description, on my videos, I share all the different equipment that I use. And I have Amazon links that go directly to Amazon. The neat thing about Amazon is somebody can use your link to get in there not by the item that you were promoting, but by something else. And because you sent them there, everything they buy for the next 24 hours, you get a percent of. It might be 48 hours. It's either 24 or 48. But think about that at Christmas time. That's when you really want to be pushing it because everybody is shopping on Amazon. But that's just an example. But what about higher priced recurring income? I like to look at tools that I use I, I and then I promote. Now, there's a new tool that I started using called Deadline Funnel. And what it is, I'm gonna show you what it is first because I wanna show you why I like it, but then I'll show you what process I go through to find out if it is an affiliate product, okay? Very quickly, Deadline Funnels is, it's a, it's when you go to, an offer and you're sent to somebody's landing page, which to you is just a page on your, your internet, you're gonna see a timer there. And it says, you only have 15 minutes to take, care, uh, take advantage of this offer. You only have four hours or four days and that timer is running. Well, many of those timers, like if you go to, if you use a, a tool, which I use all the time called ClickFunnels, they have a timer on there that you can use, but that timer isn't really a timer. For instance, if you, let that timer run out, go right back in the same link using the same email address, the timer will start all over again. So it's more of a, it's there to get you worried about the time running out. But if you use a deadline funnel timer, that timer runs out and it will redirect the customer to another page showing the higher priced item. And if they log back into that, that same landing page using that email address, the timer does not show up again. They've lost that opportunity. So it's a real timer and that's what I love. It's an evergreen marketing funnel tool. So that's what it is. Now you can use these timers on your landing pages. You can use them in your emails you can integrate with other things i mean it's it's tons of of you know things that it does but that is it in a nutshell now let's say i just found out about deadline funnel how would i go about trying to find out if it has a partner program the first thing i would do is type in google does deadline funnels have an affiliate program i've done this with other products that i have used and right away you'll find out if you look down here it says welcome to our affiliate program so they do have one now some products when you go in and you follow those links you're going to find out that you're not allowed to offer their product unless you're a customer deadline funnel did not happen to be that way um, when I went in and hit that link, it brought me to a page that said, uh, how do I join the Deadline Funnel Affiliate Program? And right below here, you can fill out the information. And actually, you have to hit the link all the way at the bottom of the page. And it gives you all the directions on how to fill it out. And once you fill it out, you're in their system, they're going to send you a unique link called your affiliate link. And you'll start promoting that. So this is how you get paid. This is the part you really want to pay attention to. Any product that you sign up for, just follow the steps, get in there, um, become an affiliate. You're going to have a dashboard. They're going to track your sales. They're going to, if, you know, by the month or by seven days, whatever you want, they'll, cut, they'll let you know how much of a percent they're giving. Many of these recurring re, memberships or, or um, when people are paying a monthly fee, you keep getting a percent of that. That's recurring. Um, many of them pay anywhere from 20 to 30%. Some are 15%. This one in particular is 20%. And you might say, well, 20%, all right, to sign up for this, it's $37 a month. Imagine having 100 people sign up. That's $3,700. You get 20% of that, which is roughly, roughly $700 a month just for having 100 people sign up. 10 people would be $70 a month. But it, it's something that you keep promoting and it builds and it builds and it builds. 
I always want to make sure I'm promoting a tool that is relevant that I hope that people will like it as much as I did and that's and then I will promote it I don't like promoting things just because I think that I can make money off of it and that's what a lot of people do when they start doing affiliate marketing and then when you start promoting it you don't sound as sincere I can guarantee you 100% love this product and it's new to me actually I just started using it about three months ago and then I thought hmm I wonder if they have an affiliate program because I loved it so much so um, with the affiliate program once you sign up and everything they'll just follow the directions they have help and all of that then they're gonna send you a unique link and that link I have it below to show you and I'm gonna um, hit it now but that link will take you as the person wanting more information directly to their landing page and it's right here now look up here in the heading it says deadlinefunnel.com and then that unique number is my number so anybody that comes in I'm gonna say use necessary cookies anybody that comes in and tries the free trial or logs in and wants to buy right away and join then they're connected to me and they're one of my customers or one of my um, under my affiliate partner program and that's how that works and how do you get paid many affiliate programs want you to wait until you make a hundred dollars some of them say 50 whatever their rules are and then they will send you a check to an account that you've set up sometimes they want you to set it up into a checking account and sometimes you can use PayPal you just have to follow their directions but once people hit this link and they start signing up then you start accumulating this list of people that are partnering with you with this product and it's really that simple now how do you track it well you don't have to worry about all of that I do track I use OneNote I know a lot of people use Google Docs and things like that I have started putting some of my stuff in Google Docs so it doesn't get lost but I love OneNote and what I do is I have a whole notebook called um, of my affiliates and these are my affiliates and then deadline funnel is here I always have my login information on the first tab and then I have my affiliate link on the next tab now along with this um, typically I will start and I haven't like I said I've only had this for this I've been an affiliate just for about a month but then I'll start making things like pretty links and those are the links that I'll keep track of as well um, if there's any training I'll keep track of that how do I go in this one in particular has um, a training program from the company and I have an account and I can go through all the training um, so I can look at that there's a really good article that I found about it and then they have what they call mink links that means you can um, use your affiliate link and turn it into a link that's unique to you so if you want to put your name on it or your business name or something like that but this particular affiliate program those are the things that I have that I'm tracking um, again I would definitely suggest you put everything in a OneNote or on an Excel sheet and then put it up into a Google Drive so that you have your information because the more you get into this business the more you're going to have to track and you don't want to lose all your information but like I said I also usually have a tab that says pretty links and then I make sure I have those links here and when I promote my product it's there now you're saying well what do you mean promote your product well I just promoted this product to you on YouTube I just showed you some of the things that it does I didn't do a heavy review because my my purpose of talking to you right now was to show you the process now if I was really pushing deadline funnel to you I would go in and maybe do a review I could take you into the um, the account and show you how to make a campaign and how it actually works which I probably will but then I will say hey hit my link below and you can check it out and get a free trial and that's when like I said um, that's when I have pretty links made and things like that so I can promote it on YouTube I can promote it on Facebook on Instagram any of your social media accounts and you're promoting your link and getting people to check it out so that's how it works in a nutshell and it does work and you do want to have more than one product but you don't want to have 20 or 30 products I recommend that you start promoting products that you're actually using now sometimes I might say hey um, here's a camera that I use as part of my equipment this is one I'm looking at and maybe say hey if you if you want to upgrade use this but typically I don't typically I will promote things that I'm using because it's easier and I can sincerely tell you that it is a good product so hopefully that was helpful if you have any other questions I know it seems vague if you don't go in find an affiliate partner program 
find something you're using and Google it and say, do you have a partner program? Sometimes they do and sometimes they don't. I know Hootsuite right now no longer um, is adding any more affiliates. They had a program, they have people that are promoting it, but they feel like they have enough so they stopped adding. And a lot of programs will do that. They'll, they'll, um, they'll uh, accumulate so many affiliates and then they'll stop for a while, regroup, maybe change things and then open it back up again. And that's okay, there's lots of them out there. But I highly recommend that you have at least five that you really concentrate on and really focus on um, promoting. I really recommend that you promote, um, concentrate on promoting those four or five until you have um, a lot of videos, a lot of content out there and you're get, getting some revenue and then maybe add some other things and maybe start adding some more high ticket things. But this is a recurring income. People sign up, they have to pay a monthly fee and then you get that monthly commission. So you want to have at least four or five different affiliate programs like that so that that commission keeps coming in. All right, hopefully this was helpful. Make sure you subscribe to my channel, hit the notification button so that you are notified every time I put out a new video. And I do put them out weekly, so make sure you hit that. And I will. I thank you for watching and I will see you on the next video.